before hanging up, but I think that's that's fine. So what's up? Well, you know, you know what happened, don't you? Uh, yeah. That I shot Miguel. Uh, I heard Miguel was in ICU, oh, so but uh, ICU, I didn't know so you shot. Him. Okay. Mhm. Mm well, I, I shot him because it was self-defense. <laughs> There's not more to it. Uh, I'm gonna ask you, or I'm I'm gonna ask you to do something, and you can do it if you want to. But at okay. the end of the day, it's your choice. I want you to talk to Mr. K, gang leader to gang leader. Okay. And tell them that what happened was between Miguel and I. And it was self-defense. Right. It was either him or I. And if I was the one that went down, nobody would have bet an eye. I waited and I only shot after he shot, showing that he was willing to kill me, so I shot him. I, I understand that, but I don't think that matter much to him. No, probably not. But at least we can try, because... They're they basically they are upset that he failed to kill me. That is what they're upset about. That is the that is their hand right now, is that he he got shot because he tried to kill somebody else. You get the picture, you know what I mean. Like, yeah, let's go you, let's go up there, man. Alright. Did you bring food or did you forget? I did. Okay. But yeah. Oh, thank you. Uh, just talk to him. That's that's the one thing people need to do in the city. Even if you don't get anything from him, just talk to him. At least you tried. Communication, uh, sure. communication is... That's not a problem. Yeah. He's usually awake for a little bit before uh, when I wake up, so I'll talk to him before that. I'll just deliver the message. Yeah. And if he wants mm. the rundown, if he doesn't trust you, he can call me. I don't care. I'll give him the rundown as well of what happened. But this sure. is all, from start to finish, this is all on Miguel. He's the one yeah. that antagonized. He's the one that went to the cops. He's the one that stole from me. He's the one that outed me. He's the one that set this up. He's the one that wanted to make amends, but was in reality a trap. Yeah. Uh, do you know what happened to Nick? I heard about the whole Lang thing, yeah. All right. Well, I am going to be leaving. Why? Because... Nick is on a warpath and he doesn't seem to realize that he is causing one hell of a shitstorm for a lot of people other than himself. So what happened yesterday is because he stormed off in, a, in the heat of the moment instead of hearing the entirety of what happened did he tell you what happened did he tell you what how he got from that point to what ended up trending? he was telling me that andy told him something but in a in, a, in the wrong way yeah so communication again but that happens basically told him that uh like jaeger was trying to control her not being like you know close to you guys or something like that if that is what said she's, wrong. yeah, if that's what she said, sure. But he should still fucking pick up his phone when people try and call him. Jaeger, okay. I guess they talked again because she called me. But Jaeger didn't try to control her. He told her to back off because it looked bad that she was doing stuff for us. And with everything going on between Lang and, and Nick, and the reason I'm saying between Lang and Nick is because I have no involvement. Um, okay. 
they, she could be caught in the middle. And that's why she called me first and said, I want, I want to back off a bit. I don't want to be a part of this. And I said, that's fine. I don't, it's understandable. Who said that? That Andy. Okay. And then she called Nick. And I'm assuming while she was trying to explain the same thing to Nick, even if, if she dis, did say it in a wrong way or he misheard it, he hung up on her, said the Jaeger is going to regret it, went to the ICC with a gun in hand, and that is enough for Lang to go fucking nuclear. Lang, Jaeger is the only thing Lang cares about. Okay. So that's what led to the whole uh, casino incident then? I would assume so, yes. Okay, but wasn't this just all a misunderstanding? How was it a mis... Well, well, it was a misunderstanding from our side. But why, why should, why should Lang care about that? War Lang, Lang is already on a warpath with Nick. They're, they're both going at each other. That is just giving him ammo to justify his actions. Mm hmm. So tell, tell me again how that makes you want to leave. I, I need a break. I need to not wake up every, I, I need to not wake up and put out fires. <laughs> I am going to come what, back. Can you, can, you, can you be a bit more specific on what fires you're putting out when you wake up? Nick's fucking fires. With Lang and him. You know, I'm, I'm, I'm losing friends left and right because of this, right? People that I care I about. I understand. People I get being, you. People are being told to choose a side. And most of them will choose... Lang, unfortunately, but it is what it is. <laughs> okay, then my okay. Who's being forced to choose a side? Can you explain that a little bit more? Everyone. Who's everyone? Everyone that has to do with like Nancy. Nancy. I called Nancy yesterday. Nancy said that hey, we cannot be friends anymore. Well, you can okay. laugh all you want, and you can you can make you can crack your jokes about us sleeping together or whatever. She's, she's uh, no, friend. I'm not laughing because of that. No, I'm just saying that she said that we cannot be friends anymore. She also told me that apparently we tried to assassinate Lang with Psy Carter, meaning that what? Meaning that Lang is spinning a narrative that okay. is untrue. Do you tell me that a fucking Sai shot somebody? Well, Sai did shoot Lang, but it has nothing to do with assassination. Mm -hmm. It kind of shot him. Maybe not like, you know, preemptive planned, you know? No, he shot him because he got noseballed. From what, what Sai told me. He's an idiot, okay. don't get me wrong. Sai is a fucking stupid person for even shooting the mayor when he's obviously getting baited, but Sai is Sai. It was an assassination attempt. Nick and I didn't have anything to do with it. It wasn't political. It was just Sai being a dumb fuck. Okay. Uh, seeing as Nancy is being asked to make a choice means that everyone else that might be close with Lang is gonna get told the same thing. Eve, Lexi, and probably Jaeger. I am trying to get a hold of Jaeger, but oh my god, is he fucking impossible to get a hold of. Alright. So... So that... So the fact that Lang is fighting with the Nick causing you to lose some of your friends and stuff like that that you don't like that no it, it, i'm being involved with i'm getting dragged into this with without consent dragged into this by you essentially associ talking about by association like nancy because of the issues that you know nick is causing some i see 
I'm gonna have to talk to Jaeger because right now, if Jaeger is only but seen... I don't know, what do you? I mean, that's that's always gonna happen when like anybody's involved with Lang, though, right? What? Like that's he's the... always gonna like, like he will always fuck over anybody else uh, in terms of association and shit like that. Doesn't matter what the scenario is. Yeah, but there's a different way to go about it. Pulling out a fucking gun and going hunting for his son is not the. You can't st stand there and say that's a good move. I don't think it's a good move, but uh, I don't know, man. I, I, I think, I think th this is. Can I be honest with you, man? Like, I don't want to hurt your feelings, bro. You know, I love you, man. Mm -hmm. I, I, I feel like you and your brother both a little bit naive, man. Why are we naive? What? Because, because a lot you guys don't understand a lot of shit that's going on, man. Like, like Nick's out here talking to me, like he's confused how people don't have integrity, bro. I, I, I told him, brother, this is Los Santos, man. People want money, material gain, and nothing else. That's the main thing. And, and he's out here getting stressed out. He's talking like I fucked him up when I, when I talked to him earlier because I told him the reality of all the fucking voting issues and shit like that. You know what I mean? Like he he don't get it, bro. You, you you know what I'm saying? And like, and for you, bro, I'm sorry, man. Like you, I get that your friends are going away from you, but you make some fucking shitty friends too, man. You, you I mean, like I remember when 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 we talked about Miguel in the past, you were like, oh no, he never do nothing to me. Look at you now. Well, You're yeah. not stressed about the shit Nick's bringing up, bro. You just stress more. It's just additional stress from the fucking shit that Miguel did. No, not really. But what do you mean, no? The Miguel thing is handled to some degree, I guess. No, it's not handled, no. motherfucker. Okay, there's going to be fallout. Uh-huh. Uh, see, see this, Michael? All I'm saying is, okay, don't compartmentalize the issues. Like, it's, <laughs> oh, yeah, you know, if Nick didn't do anything with a big dick measuring contest, you know, there is different ways to go about it. At the end of the day, that's what I'm saying. But Nick keeps making questionable decisions. One, blowing up Lang's car and leaving my name behind is one thing. Now going after his son, when I've told him specifically that Lang is, or Jaeger is the only thing that matters to Lang. Jaeger is the only person keeping Lang at bay in terms of going after me. <laughs> He, he, he knows this. Tell, tell me something, all right? Okay. I, I understand all this, okay? But, like, ultimately, things are never fucking sweet in the city, right? Something was going to come up in the future now, you know, now or two years from now. It doesn't fucking matter, right? Sure. Doesn't it, doesn't it tell you something that people that you thought were in your pocket or on your side are simply not? Does that not does that not like fucking ring any bells in your head? Say that again. Does it not make you think or wonder why every friend that you thought was close to you, right, who is now forced to make a decision, has not chosen you? Sure. Like, doesn't that say something to you? Sure. Like, like for me right now, right, like. Like my, my I, I don't, I don't care. You might think I'm bad shit crazy, right? But this is probably the point where I tell my brother, yo, bro, let's go, man. Let's chill out together. It's all about my day ones. Mm -hmm. You know, that that's what I feel like should be done. I think that would calm him down a lot, would fucking sort your fucking head out a lot. But instead, you guys are like fucking, who cares about the rest, man? They don't give a shit about any of you anyway. Maybe they do, but not as much as they care about Lang. Like, what, what the fuck is the thing, man? Like, what, what, what's going on here? The, the, the problem, at the, ultimately, right? Right. It's clear that the two of you are just not as close as you need to be right now, man. And that might sound weird, but you don't get me, bro. You don't get me. I know <laughs> why Nick is trying to go against Lang. It's a big dig measuring contest that was also... Because you seem to not have his back. I remember that conversation with you. Sure. You know what I'm saying? And yeah. then you 
and then and then I remember him telling me that you know you talking to your friends and shit like that, but you know you seem to have so much love for them, but they ain't got the same for you. So you're you're both fucked up, man. You just need each other, man. You know that's that's my main thing. I am. Okay, at least I'm not going on a seven day fucking drunk bender. I'm just taking time to clear my head. No, I I agree that I agree with that, man. But I'm I'm, I'm just saying right now, boys. Okay. The Simones need to be together rather than apart, okay? You can sure. take your break. You can rest whatever you want. But when you come back, Michael, okay, this, this, is, this needs to be very clear for your fucking head. And the problem for you is that sometimes people like me are not with you all the time. So you go on these fucking conversations. You yip yap. You talk to whoever from the cops to the fucking ops to the fucking snakes. And then... Because, you know, you don't got your day ones with you. You say, okay, yeah, yeah, this person is nice to me. They're good to me. They're telling me a lot of shit, bro. But fuck me, man. Look. Look at everything. Even me today. People that I've been dealing with. People that I thought were real ones, man. Fucking snap some money in their face. They're gone. And who, who am I left with, bro? My day ones once again. The people that, you know, grew my gang with me. People like you, man. Yeah, I know you since like, you were nobody, this man. This is literally like lying. What the fuck you talking about? He's being parent. He's telling you, you, to you be know what I'm saying. You need lying. to reassess the shit that you're fucking doing. Nick has to do the same shit as well. This motherfucker talking about having 500 million, one billion. I don't see a single cent he throw in yet, but I understand why he hasn't done it yet. You know what I'm saying? I understand why he hasn't done it because it's a very you know <laughs> it's, it's a very difficult, right <laughs> very difficult situation he's in when it comes to the economy of the city and whatnot. Mm -hmm. But I just told him like today, man. I said, be realistic, bro. Lang is throwing around fucking 20 million just to get a house to buy votes. We out here fucking trying to riz. You know what I mean? Like you guys uh This this is the this is the thing, right? This is the thing people always assume about me, Michael, okay? Because I like to joke because I'm not so serious all the time like you motherfuckers or you dumb fucks. The difference is I know how shit needs to get done. Mm -hmm. Because I've done it. You know what I'm saying? I've done it from nothing. You take away my bench, I'm still me. You know? Mm -hmm. Nobody can fuck with me. You know what I'm saying? I got the loyalty of my people because they're with me. That's it. But y'all... I want to ask if you can do it. This is why I accent. told you, bro. This is why I told you, man. Helping everybody was never going to fucking help you, motherfucker. No, I see. You know what I'm saying? You, yeah. you, do you understand me, motherfucker? I want to fucking shave your hair bald, man. I'm so pissed with you. <laughs> what is it with you in shaving? I know you like your hair. I'm already fucking... I, uh, I don't have hair. You get me, right, bro? I just... <laughs> there's nothing I can say to you, man. There's nothing I can say to you. Everybody around us wants something, man. And there's only a few, even in my circle, that I know that I can rely on. You, Michael, I tell you right now, bro. Wish that come. I would never betray you. <laughs> I know. I will die for you. I know. You know, it doesn't matter. I don't give a fuck. People want to give me a fucking skyscraper. They want to do whatever. They ask me to choose this, choose that. No, I won't. It doesn't matter. My boys know this too. Seaside knows this too. I told them, anything from you goes. It's simple, man. I know. I'm very, I, I'm <laughs> all about my day ones, my family, for real. It's not some shit I'm just spitting out, bro. You know what I'm saying? I know. I will lose everything for you, man. But the thing is, you got to stop fucking around, man. Because it hurts me to see you like this, bro. You know why? Because it's shit. It's shit. You look silly. You're trying to hide and shit. You don't know how to hide. I'm the one who knows how to hide. And I feel like I can't be there for you, man. But the people that can be around for you right now, they ain't here no more. I know. I know you're you, you're my day one. You're my OG, and I would throw everything away for you as well. But you, can you fucking while I'm gone? Can you try and straighten out Nick? Can you give him a wake up call as well? I will. I will. I talked to him today, and he seems to understand that. This is this is him, okay? Every time I told F8, him oh, how to expect what Lang will do, 
I had a situation with the Saints house for people to be flipping votes and shit like that. I called exactly what was going to happen. Play by fucking play. How? Because I know how people operate, man. Motherfucker, I was with Speedy for two fucking years. Every single move Lang made, he would fucking story tell to me. You know what I'm saying? Anything, if you think it's possible, they will do it. If it can be affordable, they will afford it. It's very simple. And Nick just realized that, that, oh, wow. We actually don't have that many real one friends around us. Yeah, we don't. And people are flip-flopping in a second. And I'm telling you right now, you guys want to do what you want to do right now? We can. But we got to start doing it right. You, wanna con you got to consolidate the power that we got. Get the real ones going. And when shit hits the fan, we actually have money. We actually got people that can die for us. That's all it is, man. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you so much for 11 months. Just Charles. I'm not telling you that you can't have friends. All right. I'm not trying to say that. But, uh, I Michael. Need to pick better friends. You have to pick better friends. And even when you're smiling, Guards. you're having fun. Guards 3 is You're chit chatting, you're yapping, working, you feel like, good. hey, this is a real one right here. They're not. They're not. You want to be, you, you actually want to know how if they're a real one? I'll tell you if they are. Simple. I'll do a check for you, man. I can smell it on them. Sure. I literally can smell it on motherfuckers, bro. I will make sure to bring my, my friends back home, dad, and then you can yeah take a look no like literally that's what needs to be fucking done so that you don't fuck up again man yes dad so uh you're probably going to meet nick later right i don't think so well i will try to talk to him but trust me when i say that if he michael i know it's hard for you to be sappy but you know Take that energy that you would have used to talk to everybody else. Use it in a conversation with your brother at some point when you're back or before you leave. Mm -hmm. Leave him a voicemail or whatever the fuck it is. I'll try. Just yeah. remind him. Just remind him that it all begins with family. That you understand that shit went wrong and that will never happen again. And that in the future, we will tackle these problems together. <laughs> That's all it is. Emily. It's simple, man. It's simple. I know, man. You got to keep the cards close. And that's going to be the deck you play with forever. Yeah. And tomorrow, when Nick wakes up, he's probably going to feel some type of way. But uh, hopefully he's a bit more level-headed. Hopefully. Or a little bit more... Uh, Humble in his uh, option taking, okay? <laughs> and as for you, uh -huh. I'm sure that once I go to sleep, you're going to go on at least seven more phone calls. Probably. And everybody, everybody and their mom, okay, is going to start to tell you what to do, how to behave, how to act. And trust me, it's all bullshit. Okay, it's all bullshit. No, I think just only... follow your heart what you want to do okay and yeah. as long as you nick no problem that's it right the only phone call i've left is the acre if i can get a hold of him i think everyone everyone else is taken care of all right bro so I, one last thing that I, I need to talk to you about what is this uh, reggie tells me that you are uh, you might have an option for a court case do you think that's safe uh it's either that or nothing like they send a plea deal or a rough sketch of a plea deal, but I don't know. It doesn't look that interesting. At the end of the day, it might be better to take it to court. The issue is finding a, a lawyer who's capable. Uh, we... I I was telling I was telling Reggie, mm -hmm. no matter what lawyer you get, it's hard because it's not Reggie. Because I know Reggie would be invested the shit. Yeah. But whatever lawyer you get now would just be catching up on shit, not really aware of what you've been doing or what your impact has been on the city, and you wouldn't be as dialed in. That's my only issue. Hmm. That and the fact that your safety will be in question uh, during the court case, because uh, you will probably be bombed before, after, during. 
the court case. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I, I think that I feel like you need to ponder on that a little bit more. Maybe make your decision while you're while uh, you're I'm away. Not, yeah, I'm not gonna make the decision now. Uh, I talked yeah. to Reggie. I think we should make them do a better plea deal, or at least hatch out the plea deal, and give us exactly what they're trying to push, and then go from there. And if it's still shit, we'll just have to fight it in court, and then we'll need to figure out. Yeah. If, you know, it shouldn't be a public court, of course, because I feel like right now, if I go to court, someone someone is going to walk in there with a fucking ceramic pistol and try and shoot my ass. Exactly. I don't think it'd be a wise idea. No. I think, uh, let Reggie do his magic for the coming week while you're away. Yeah. And then, you know, if there's something that can be done in a court case, which seems viable, maybe he can push that through. And when you arrive, you do that immediately so that people might be caught off guard and not be prepared enough to, to kill you. But other than that, maybe just, yeah. Tim, I don't know who that is. Yeah. All right. But yeah, if I don't, if I don't get to talk to him, I'll... I'll let him know I'm leaving for a bit. At least I'm not going on a fucking drinking spree for seven days. I'm just taking, taking, you know, I'm taking a bit of time. Yeah, don't say that to him. Don't say that to Nick. Just say you're there for him, man. And just tell him you need him to be there for you and that's it. <laughs> no need to have snide remarks and fuck each other off. You guys are all you got left, man. Ain't nobody there, Michael. Ain't nobody there. It's going to be the same shit. All right. No matter what, Michael, <laughs> do not let snakes get close to you again. They won't. Doesn't matter. It doesn't matter if it's a goddamn fucking python or a fucking tiny earthworm. No snakes okay. allowed in this right. house. Exactly. No more. No more. Jesus fucking Christ. And it doesn't matter if they're hot, yeah? Doesn't matter if they're hot, Michael. Resist. They're still a snake. Resist. Exactly. Remember. Just remember how close you were to Nancy, to all the people you're talking to, to all the cops that you talk to at the end of the day. It's because I haven't turned up. You are expendable to them. Right. That's it. Remember that, and that will serve you very well the rest of your life in the goddamn city. Yeah. Yep. I know. I'm the snake wrangler. Remember that. Snake whistler. I really am. You're just missing the missing the. <sighs> fucking what's the flute? The, the flute. Yeah. The flute. Yeah. All right, brother. You take care. Okay. All right. Go get some sleep. Do not get caught the day before you decide to go away. It's no. Like yeah. Yeah. It's Reggie. It's Pretty Reggie. much on par. Exactly <laughs> on time. Oh, Reggie, Reggie, I'm so sorry. I forgot to ping you. <laughs> Reggie, you say this, but I know because of a speech that I just gave to Michael that you are one of my day ones and you will never kill me, bitch. So shut up. Exactly. I can, well, I can literally hear him yelling through the now phone. Now you know why Michael and I are friends. We have long phone calls and conversations. <laughs> Where are you? I want to talk to you. Okay, I'll see you soon. All right. Mikael. Yeah. I shall see you soon. Do you know how to be safe? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I've survived for six months. I should be fine. Yeah. Okay. All right. Do you have, do you have KJ's number and all these other guys? Like, legit, bro. You need to. Uh, I don't have KJ's number, I think. No, just. Do you have Dragon's number? No. Okay, Can you. Write uh... down this number. Okay. Uh, you want me to text it to you? Uh. No. 
Just uh, could you make a document with numbers on it and just send to me? Jesus, how do you do that? Okay, never mind. What is dragon? Okay, dragon is awake during your time. Right. Okay, he is not a Navy SEAL expert, but he is an expert dispatcher. Meaning, right. if you call him, he will assemble anybody that's out, uh, you know, ride or die. Okay. Mm -hmm. 